We'll guide you through how to edit a Minecraft texture pack or resource pack. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This is really useful to do, and you can go and change something very minor, or you can make loads of changes. It's going to be up to you. So let's get right into this. First of all, just come and close out of the game you're currently in. Now what you need to do is go and get the texture pack you want to do this with. So what you can do is come into Minecraft, click on options and resource packs, and click on open pack folder. This is a pack you want to do this with. What you can then do is go and right click on it, and you can go and press copy or control and C, and you can go and paste it on your desktop. Alternatively, if you want to do this with the vanilla texture pack and you don't currently have any resource packs, what you can do is go and open up a web browser, and you want to just go and search for Minecraft default texture pack. You can get one called vanilla default, click on files, you can scroll down and see the different versions and go to the right, click on the three dots and click on download file. And just like that, we've now gone and downloaded the texture pack. If I come into my downloads, here it is, and I'll place it on my desktop. So now that you've got your pack, you'll need to go and unzip it, right click on it, and you need to go and click on extract all, press extract, and it'll then be extracted to a folder. A big thank you to the sponsor of this video, Apex Hosting. If you're in need of a Minecraft server, then definitely check them out. At the moment, you can get 25% off. I'll go and put a link down below, which you can check out. And they've got so many awesome features as well, like one click install more packs, DDoS protection, 24 seven servers and support. So you can get the help anytime you need it, as well as ultra latency, instant setup and many others you can go and see here as well. So if you're interested, there'll be a link down below which you can check out. When it finishes, it should automatically open. Otherwise, you can go and find it and go and open up the pack. Now, what we can do is we can go into Assets, come into Minecraft, and you want to go and find Textures. Now, we can start going through these different folders and seeing the different textures, as you can see. So now you can start going and editing them. As I said, you may want to do this with just some specific ones, or you may want to go and change a little bit on them all. So go and find one you want to do this with. Personally, I'm gonna go and search for grass like so, and I want to do this with the grass block side. So I'll go and right click on it. And what you need to do is tap on open with, or hover over I should say, and select paint. Paint will already be on your computer. So you can go and click there, and here it is. To go and zoom in, you can use the zoom function in the bottom right here, and you can go and click, hold and drag to go and zoom in like so. Now, what you can do is go to the top and you can go and use the different tools here. So in this case, we can go and use a brush. So I'm gonna click here and you can go and choose the color you're looking for. You can be more specific as well if you want. And what you can then do is go and start editing it as you can see. When you're finished, you then need to go and click on file and go and click on save like so. And that's it, you can close it and it's now gonna be updated. And so you get the idea, you can work your way through the different blocks and go and customize them. Once you're finished, you want to go and come out of it and come back just to the folder here. You want to go and click, hold and drag to select them, then right click, and you want to hover over, compress to, and select zip file. We've now gone and made them into a zip, and you can go and name this what you want. I name it my pack, for example. Then what you can do is drag it onto your desktop so it's easily accessible. Now to install it, come back to Minecraft. You need to come to the resource packs by clicking options, then resource packs and click on open pack folder and you can drag and drop it in like so. And as you can see, it's now there. So go and apply it, we press the arrow, press yes, that's fine. Press done and now I'm gonna show you it in a world. So here we are, the main things I changed were the dirt block as you can see there. And I also changed oak trunks. As you can see, they've got some black on them as I added it. 